In this video we're going to have a look at how you can edit cues and things that are recorded already on the Quick Cue software. So first of all in my playback 4 here I've got a cue, my stage wash cue here and say I wanted to change the colour of these fixtures out uh, to blue for example. Uh, well what I do first of all is select the fixtures and then make live the change I want to make. So go to colour, change the colour of my lights to blue for example, like so. Now normally if I was to press record and select the playback or select the same one it would record another cue onto that playback. Instead of selecting the playback once you press record select show options and here you'll see an option here to merge. When you select merge and then select your playback it will then merge what's currently uh, up here into our cue so it merges that colour change. If I now hit the clear button at the top and now reactivate this playback you can see that's now changed to the blue colour. Uh, what happens if you've got a chase or a cue stack and you want to modify say one of the cues in the middle? Uh, well if I've got myself a chase here of my spots which is going red, uh, green and then blue like so. If I open up my cue stack window so I can see my three cues. With the playback selected I use the pause key to stop my chase and I step through say to cue number two there which is in green and I'll decide that instead of being green I want that to be magenta. Well exactly the same thing. Go home, select the fixtures change the colour like so, record, show options, merge and select my playback. Now because I've got more than one cue on that playback it now gives me an option would you like to merge this uh, information in our programmer with Q2 only for current cue I'm in or every cue in that stack so I can say just Q2, hit my clear button and you can see there that that information is now changed. You can merge to multiple cues at the same time, so if I wanted to say uh, change the position of those lights in all three cues while leaving the colour exactly as it is, so independent colour in each of the cues, I select my four spots, go to position, and I can say tilt the lights so they're facing forward like so, record, show options, merge, select my cue stack here and say all cues and now when I press clear you can see that as I step through those three cues in that chase, getting red, magenta to blue now, it's taken that new position into all three of the cues but left the colour information and other attribute information exactly as it was in the cue, so it's just merged in that position information. You can do exactly the same on your left hand faders here uh, when they're in cue mode, so if I bring down this playback here, if I go home, select my spots, like so, switch them on, set them in the colour, say blue, Record that as a cue there. I've got now a single cue here. If I want to edit the colour of that to green, for example, I can simply select my four spots on my home screen again, change the colour to green, record, show options, merge there, and overwrite the information there. So that's how you can very quickly edit cues using your Quick Cue console.